and welcome back to more FTL Captain's Edition with me, Jazeero. Whew, alright, let's jump right back in. So, we're looking for a store, we're hoping for a store, we need weapons. Ugh, no store. Alright, well, let's go out of this nebula into more open space, hopefully we can find a store. Or just some weapons, anyway. Last time, um, well not last time, but the time before that. Oh my god, light anti-crew drone. That's a drone, and it would cost me a crew member. We're just gonna kill these guys. They have missiles, they have bombs, and they have an ion weapon. They have two shields. That's a scary customer. We're gonna have to kill them, though, because we're not giving away one of our guys. Jacket Panda V2 and Little Tufts are staying with us. But yeah, uh, a couple, two episodes ago, I think, I tried to buy a weapon from some pirates, and it just stole my money. And I was feeling very sad. But anyway... We don't give in to pirate demands. Power the weapons and prepare to fight. Your crew reports, all defensive assets are ready, Captain. Good, we're gonna need them. So yeah, so in this case, for example, I definitely want to hit the weapons, but there's something to be said for hitting just three empty rooms and doing six damage, because one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. You know... If we hit the weapons twice, like we could take away one power from their weapons, but then it'll take a lot longer to kill them. I think I'm gonna try this 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 tactic. So we're gonna try this tactic. Uh, we need to cloak when those missiles and the bombs fire. So we're gonna try to just focus on just killing them. Ah. Oh, damn it. Um, yeah, we need to hit twice, though. That's going to be a problem. Damn it! This is a real issue. I think... Oh, I wish I could dodge all of this. I wish I could dodge all of this. This in my shield. Oh my. Well. Okay, the plan has changed. We're gonna hit the shields. I need. I need. Oh my god. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay. Um. We're gonna have cooking ready right now. Okay. Right, I need my weapons back online. More dodging right now. Oh, oh. Oh, that's bad. <sighs> oh, we took a lot of damage from this fight. I only have one shield, though, right now. Oh, no, we... No. Come on. Okay, I think we can just end this right here. Oh, no. We're not accepting your surrender. Oh, another damage. 21 scrap. That's good scrap, but... We took way too much damage here. It's those two shields again. Like, the plan would have worked beautifully if they didn't dodge twice because of those two shields. <sighs> and that's a problem. That's a problem we're gonna keep having until we can get more firepower. Uh, maybe having some oxygen would be better than having two <laughs> two engines. All right, that's fine. <sighs> a store. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna go do any of this distress and stuff. We need weapons. We have the scrap. Let's go to the store. Please have weapons. You arrive at an outpost of the Insta Interstellar Trade Union, a wing of light cruiser, ensure that local trade space is well protected. We're not gonna buy anything. 
They have weapons. Okay, everyone, things are fine. They have weapons. All right. Okay. Uh, light defense drone, we're definitely selling that. Fuel, we don't really need. Uh, repar uh, repairs, we might need. Uh, getting someone else could be interesting. Okay. Three power. 14 second charge time. Four shots. I think we're going to have to go for this one. The bow beam. Incapacitate ship and crew. Fire bombs. Two power. Slightly slower than normal fire bomb. Does more damage. Doesn't do any system damage though. Uh, I wish we had something that could do system damage. Okay, we're gonna buy the burst scatter too, because with its four shots, that's really gonna make a big difference for us. It's only the, the really only the the one only offensive weapon that's gonna improve what we've got. So with that in mind, we're gonna need to try to power it. That needs we can't power it. All right. Can't even power it right now. <laughs> that doesn't make me very happy. Doesn't make me very happy at all. Need more scrap. There's... I could sell the titanium system casing. Then we could power it. And then we can slowly put power back into our other system. I'm gonna do it. Because I just, I really need... I really need this. I really need this. A better weapon. Alright. So now we really need to improve our ship's uh, power. That's kind of the priority here. Repairs? Let's, let's buy repairs. Just because it's, it's going to be hard to find another place to get repairs. Oh my god, this is... I, <sighs> this is not fun. Alright, let's go hit... Let's go uh, hit these three points. Try to get some scrap. And try to... Try to get this... Uh, ship powered up properly. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Okay. Scan shows a remote settlement being blockaded by a pirate ship. The ship hastily messaged you, stay out of this or you'll be next. Concentrate fire on... <sighs> Glaive beam. That's gonna pierce my stuff. I really want to fight these guys. But this thing is, like, at least two shield piercing. And we only have two shield. Takes a while to charge, but they've got the Zoltan shield. It's going to take us at least two salvos to take that down. We're going to ignore them. I don't like it, but we're going to have to ignore them. I really don't like it, but we would definitely take tons of damage. And if that thing disables our weapons, we just can't deal with that, so... Let's jump away, sadly. I really wish we could have fought them. Ship refueling station. Um, we can't get anything of this. And these are not pirates, so we can't just attack them. That is bad right now. We are not lucky. We're getting a string of, of bad luck. Come on. Okay, a small blip appears on the system map. The sector archive lists this ship as local pirate with a long rap sheet. Unidentified cruiser. Surrender or you will be destroyed. They're closing in fast. Well, we're gonna fight them. This looks like a fight we can definitely take. This is uh, light. So this is just gonna damage our crew. So we just need to dodge the missiles with our cloaking. And then we have free reign to just disable everything in the ship. In this case, we're gonna power the burst scatter one because they only have one shield. And it's going to fire faster, it's going to let us do damage faster. They also have drones though. Depending on what those drones are and do, that might change what I'm saying. Alright. 
Okay, this is an enemy combat drone. All right, we're gonna depower this. We're gonna put power in our shields, and we're gonna power the burst, the burst scatter. Yeah. So we just need to dodge this missile. Okay. Uh, we took this out. Where do I want to hit? Uh, I think I'm gonna hit these three rooms. That way, they're gonna be worse at dodging. We do have a repair drone. I hate when it hits through the through the cloak. That's one of the things I hate the most. <sighs> All right. Well, nothing we can do about it. They're trying to fly away. Not gonna happen. The day is yours. Nope. You hit me. I'm I'm gonna destroy you. They're gonna fire again though. Crap. Oh no! No! Oh my god! Ugh. That extra damage there at the end, that extra little parting gift. Oh, that's bad. It's really painful. Ah, oh, four damage! That's way too much for a single encounter. How much is it? 25. Man, it's expensive to improve that. Uh... Alright, let's keep going. There's another store. And just nothing. Asteroid field. Uh, we can deal with an asteroid field, actually, if we uh, put more power in our shields. Let's go to the asteroid field. Also the store. Why would I want to hit the store though? I need I just need more power right now. Let's go in the asteroid field. We're low on fuel. Pirate ship was lying in wait inside the asteroid field. It immediately moves into attack. Alright, let's we're gonna attack. We're gonna have two shields here. Uh We need to cloak for these missiles, and we're gonna hit this area. Oh maybe down here. One, two, three, four. How many hit points do you got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, maybe down here. Yeah. Did I miss my shot? Mistime my shot? I think I mistimed my shot. That's really bad. And try to not. The ship is powering his FTL, trying to escape. It's okay, we're doing damage to its engines. We're not taking any damage, and they're off their piloting. Hide! Very good! Okay, the ship repeatedly hails you. It looks like they want to surrender. Three fuel, though. I'm too greedy. I'm way too greedy to accept surrenders. One fuel, 26 scrap! That's a lot of scrap. That's good. That's a really good deal there. So now we'll be able to uh, upgrade that part of our ship. Um, let's hit these empty beacons. We don't know. There could be stuff there. You come across an asteroid mining colony, they message you immediately saying Greetings, our supply of mining explosives have run out ever since the rebels blockaded the system. Do you have any extra explosive? Let's give them 15. We, we don't use missiles. Wow, this will help our effort considerably. What could I offer for your troubles? After some time, they deliver a ship augment for installation on your ship. Awesome. What, what is that? Uh, FTL jammer. Scrambles enemy F ship FTL computers, doubling the time it takes for them to jump. That's probably also going to double the time for enemies to blow themselves up. So that's pretty good, but we could also just sell it. if Because uh, I'm not that amazed by it, but we're going to keep it, and worst case, we sell it. That's a pretty good deal. In the meantime, more power to our ship. Go. We just need tons of power. Alright, let's hit this. Then we're going to either go out or go to the store. Uh, going to the store and buying some fuel might be worth it. 
You receive a message from a small convoy. They're looking for some military supplies and are offering to try and prove your reactor in exchange! We definitely agree to that trade! Upgrade your reactor by one! Well, I've been, you know, I've been avoiding all these empty beacons because I really hate hitting a beacon that's empty and getting nothing out of it and wasting a fuel. But so far, that's really awesome! All right, now we can uh, we can power the big gun. Just need more more power. Um, Seventy five. Uh, but but that's really good. That's that's a really good. Yeah, more power. Um, I'm not too bad for power. Upgrading our cloaking at this point might be the best thing to do. I think that would cost us fifty five. Uh, all right, let's hit the store. Very good! Like, this is going really well right now! That I should be careful, because usually when things go well, that's when they start going really bad. There's only one other ship at this beacon, and it is showing heavy damage. You receive a message on your console. Greetings, traveler! We were crippled by a band of pirates, and are forced to sell our remaining cargo and valuable equipment to acquire necessary supplies to get home. Okay. Uh, we're not gonna trade for any of this thing. Okay, 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 okay. There's some interesting thing to do here. Sector scanner, onboard, assembly line, ammo manufacturer, getting someone... How much is this FTL jammer worth? Only 15. That would bring us to 35. So we have... We have 35 scrap that we could deal with right now. So that's not... Well, that could be enough for this thing. Now this thing... Every 5 seconds it shoots once. It's kind of the same as the burst scatter in terms of DPS. But shooting once every five seconds is not that good because you need to go through the shields, right? So whereas two shots at once, you can go through shields. It does take two power, which is one, one more than the burst scatter. But, and that's a big difference, it does do damage to system. But I don't think I can invest in that right now. Oya Mine Launcher. Drops a pair of small mines that home in on the enemy ship and detonates in close proximity. Only damages hull. <sighs> Two shots per damage, shield piercing five, one damage, no damage to the systems, 13 seconds, requires missiles. That's not a good... I mean, it's really cheap. The has to beam... We could replace our hull beam... With the has to be, that costs 40, and that's a like a, a downgrade. Okay, so our choices are to buy some fuel and get repairs, or to stockpile this. I think buying some fuels and getting repairs right now is a really good idea. So we could buy two fuel and get everything else in repair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? That's a pretty pretty decent exchange. Now that I'm not scared about my firepower, it's not the best, but at least I'm not scared about it. So, let's go to the exit. And let's see what the next sector has in store for us. You've arrived at the long range relay. When the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. Oh, yes, please! Sell six drone part for 24 scrap. Yes, 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 yes. Please, please, let's do that. Ah. Oh. Good! That's almost another reactor upgrade, although, like I said, I'm probably going to put the point into the cloaking at this point. Yeah. Actually, I'm probably going to put it in the reactor first and then in the cloaking because that's going to give us more flexibility because we need more reactor power anyway. Only five fuel. I'm really scared about my fuel. Uh, the lower merchant hub. That's a nice place to go to. We're going to have to go to uh, basic engines. That's going to double the fleet pursuit, but... Uh, with four fuel, like we can't afford to spend any fuel. Fleet pursuit doubled for two jumps. That's really harsh. Socialize with our crew while the FDL charges. What does the humanoid crew have to say? Your humanoid crew member was stationed in this system a while ago. This gives you an idea. 
The crewman's ID codes from before the war are still valid. You're able to access the beacon network and download data on the surrounding beacons. Your map has been updating. Updated. Uh, oops. Oh, -ho, that's good. Now we have data about the whole thing. And straight away, two stores. That's kind of annoying. Uh, we Well, I guess we're going to go buy some fuel. Not a lot of enemy ships. So our path is probably to go up here, then up here, then go down in this area. And go towards the exit. Yeah, fuel is getting really, really, really critical. I mean, that fuel recycler thing from the previous ship, I really miss it. The trade depot orbits a nearby planet. Multiple merchant ships are docked. Looks like you can strike a bargain here. Buying things. I mean, the fleet pursuit's already doubled. I, I don't want them to catch up with us even more. Let's get, let's let's still look at what they have available. A crew teleporter, backup battery, mind control, Daniel the humanoid, a uh, bunch of humanoid. We're going to have to sell, I mean we could sell the burst scatter. It's worth 30. I'd like to use it though. But realistically, we're going to want to replace it with something else eventually. And right now I can't use it, and I cannot use it for the foreseeable future. The only thing that's good with it is that it gives me flexibility that I can decide to not use this and use this instead if my weapons get hit or something. That's 30 scrap. Uh, there's the FTL jammer that I would be willing to sell for 15. Get some fuel. And that's 30. What else could we buy? Just a crew member. It'd be really nice to buy a crew member, but for 45, can't afford. We'd need to get a, a better bargain, uh, is what I, I feel. Um, oh, do I sell it? <sighs> I don't like selling it. I really don't. I really don't like selling it. But I think that's the right thing to do here. We need to run this really by the wire, like really close. And right now it's dead weight. And I can't carry dead weight. Oh, it hurts so much to do. Because it's a good combination to have these two together. I'm going to do it. Now if I do this, and I stop here at 7 fuel, I can have, I can upgrade my cloaking by 1. Like right away. If not, I can buy 2 more fuel. Seven fuel is fine. We're gonna keep it here. My God, I'm making some decisions right now that might turn out to really, really bite us in the ass. This could really be bad. Alright, let's hit this beacon. Oh, look at how fast they're running after us. Just socialize with the crew. Your humanoid crew member has heard a lot about this sector. None of it is of any importance to this mission. Alright guys, gonna take a break here. Thanks for watching. Power surge detected already? We just we just took care of that. We just took care of that. I think they've abandoned me.
I think the entire village has ran away. They, they thought I'm like a terrible, terrible, terrible person. Okay. So we need to angle this thing, propel it, and release it at the right time. So, ang angle the thing, angle the thing, and then we go... Oh, 